Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So friend, in this video, I am going to discuss some important updates which is coming from the Cognigent company. So basically, they have started sending the Gen C Elevate survey mail for CSD candidates who got selected from the 23 batches because yesterday i got most uh, like i got most of the uh like doubts sir what after this when the training will start it's offline or off online how to fill a survey form each and everything i will going to discuss and all about i will tell you all about the how what is cognizant location and pnc flexibility survey so without any further delay let's begin this video and if you haven't joined my whatsapp group please do my what my whatsapp group i will provide the link in my video description okay so let's begin this video so first of all you can see on my screen okay so let's let's read the particular mail very carefully so that you can easily get to know what they are want to saying okay so here you can see a day candidate getting from cognizant we are looking forward to get you onboarded to prepare for that we request you to update on the following okay one is what is one provisional certificate you are required to confirm the ability of the provisional certificate with you this is a mandatory document and subsequently we will receive a mailer on how to upload soft copy of the provisional certificate before we are scheduled your onboarding preference will be given to those who have submitted their provisional certificate over those who have not and point number two is flexibility to join to any of our region location please note that uh, your work location is purely based on the business requirement please be uh, reference preference will be given to those who have expressed their interest to join cognizant uh, location over those who have not please provide your response just click on the particular uh, survey and not misinformation provided in the survey might lead to be delayed or to delay your training commencement okay so sir when we can expect the our training will start so basically training will start in the month of like uh, september mid this is expected okay september mid or october first week they can start once they start once i get any update any okay so how to fill survey form so uh, like after receiving this mail you can get this type of mail from the cognizant team regarding cognizant campus workshop meeting invite campus gcp uh, cep cognizant campus if you uh, that has sent you a protected message okay so let's see what how to fill the survey form so here you can see this type of things you will be getting once you get click on the survey form okay okay so we fill your association with the community uh, your response will help you to plan your onboarding with us kindly take us the minute for your time and complete the survey do remember to submit the form or not before cognizant candidate id okay you have to fill over there you, you if you uh, like uh, just take your offer letter and otherwise you will getting the candidate id also you, you, you have to register your email id and billing and also the willingness to work of our of any of the cognizant location you have to select yes and uh, this type of things you're getting a free receipt from the cognizant team regarding onboarding process so you can see okay so uh, we are okay we are inviting you to join the team session to regard with the background verification this call to check the education document which you are hold which you hold uh, please ensure to be available to a meeting along with the provision degree certificate kindly available your video during the call attend this mandatory protocol kindly join the session okay so they will find you they will give you one meeting link and your date and timing over there okay so so what are what, what are the other question if all semester is completed or not i have not i have pen card or not any location i'm comfortable and probably the certificate is a mandatory document you have to fill in the, in the survey okay so after completing your csd training program they will going to onboard you after completing your csd and after completing your exam also keep please keep in your mind that after completing the csd program you have to go with the one training uh sorry one interview one assessment also after completing the exam okay you are going to get onboarding full time okay so please keep it in my mind okay so you have to complete your training this are training i think so two to three months after completing your cup full uh, training very uh, like a uh, very uh, good and you will getting a one assessment over there and they, they based on your assessment and based on your interview are going to get a project on the company the full time if you're not able to clear they will provide you three chances and after if you're not clearing your exam they will three chances they, will, they are going to not give you a full time onboarding also okay so for the for the more pro details about csd if you want you just comment it down i will create a separate video regarding csd what is csd content development program okay so this should be